Welcome to this episode of OpenSCAD by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I just want to do a quick video to share this little widget that I whipped up with and just kind of show you how useful OpenSCAD can be. So the basis of this code was a knob that I'd come up with in the past, uh, actually for the magic nut, if you will. And what I simply did is took on the bottom and added some uh, 45 degree angles here, two of them, because what I needed to do was find the center of the side of a rod to drill a pilot hole into and, and I needed to get it dead on straight for some grub screws. So this works out great. You simply just lay it on top of the tube. It automatically finds the center. You run your pilot drill down the center hole you see here and boom Bob's your uncle you have your hole in your rod. Now this is uh, all pretty much parametric up here as you can see so you can change the size of it from the different size of the potential widget itself i.e. Uh, you know the grip diameter uh, as well as uh, you know configuring um, you know the opening and the chamfers of the different pieces uh, and, and so again you can kind of customize it to your need if you want a big one a small one I think I put a couple different sizes out on Thingiverse if you will uh, and again this is really great for drilling pilot holes on rods and this also works well with the lazy machinist bench block that we did because again you can lay the rod into that uh, and again I'll do some overlays and then put this on top of the rod drill your hole and not drill a hole in your bench or anything so anyways hopefully you found this interesting again just short little video wanted to share this with you and if you did give it a big thumbs up I'll have the code out on the open SCAD site the link will be down below and and we'll see you guys in the next video where we code something else pretty cool. Cheers.